Hey guys, Mad Rabbit back in our uh, little series here. We're taking this Torin dude, shaman guy, leveling him up. Okay, elemental spec. Well, at least it will be when we actually hit re uh, level 10 when we get to choose. So that's definitely a caster type, and uh, learning the caster type is uh, something that's a little bit new to me. I'm more used to doing melee classes, although I have dabbled with the caster types. Uh, I got quite a few characters. All right, so um, continuing from last time, let's just keep complete quest, drink the water of vision. Yeah, okay. Hmm. And they want me to do that all the way over there on the map. Okay. So I guess I'll be heading there and uh, on my way there, I will discuss the fact that I am going to be uh, changing the format here. Uh, we're going to stick with high definition, but we're not going to be doing the um, 1080p definition. A couple of people did comment, and um, yeah, it's just 1080p is a little too much uh, render time. And my, if I had two computers, I would do it in a second, no problemo. You know, uh, I could just have one computer dedicated to uploading and rendering. But uh, we're just going to stick with uh, the 720, and I've done a test in Minecraft on it. And I think we'll switch over to that format for Minecraft. And hopefully here too. And so far this place looks pretty gorgeous in 720. Um, most people are saying they don't really notice much of a difference, to be honest with you. So, and I don't think I really have either. Uh, so I think I'm going completely the wrong way here too. So I'm going to pause here and try to make my way to where I'm supposed to be going. And we'll be back right in a minute. Yeah, hi, I'm uh going back up the hill because stupid me didn't read the, the <laughs> description for this you're actually supposed to, to drink this crap up there near next to the actual guy who gives you the quest I guess I I didn't read it okay well in case you're following along and doing these quests of your own uh, now you know and knowing it's half the battle yeah and we're back again isn't this a familiar sight well I guess we'll drink this uh, oh yeah great all we need, all we need, is all this like uh, peyote smoking Indian crap. Really, we really need this. Yeah. All right. Well, I guess you turn into a little bird. I'm not controlling this. He's just gonna fly you around. Like, this is how you get over to there. Okay, that's a quest. Because um, if you're not aware, you gotta go here next, and it's kind of difficult to, to actually follow the road if you're a noob. Yeah, I guess if you're a noob, you you would have a problem following that road. You know, but. Uh, Hmm, I guess now you know. Do you actually land here, or is it just sort of end? I guess they don't even... Oh, that's interesting. They don't even have you walk there anymore. I remember I, I did run it through with that one other shaman I had that was 6th level. And you actually... You had more quests in that starter area, and you, you didn't come out here. Wow, that's just kind of freaky. Hmm. Well, at any rate, turn in... Oh, level 5 Earth Shock. Alright, that's cool. Uh, kill 15 gnolls. It looks like we got quite a few other little quests here I can see on my mini map. I like being panned out as far as I can so I can see as many of these things as you can. And if you are a noob and you are new to Warcraft, and uh, you always want to grab as many of the quests as you can whenever you go to a quest hub. Um, even if you don't do them, I mean, just to grab them and, you know, so you don't have to run back. Um, most of these are just, looks like they're just kill this, kill that quest, huh? Bring eight trophies. Yeah, mostly just killing. And let me just grab this new ability, Earthshock. Deals moderate nature damage. Hmm, I'm not really sure what... Obviously, I'll take it, but uh, I got two new abilities now, and I don't really know how to use them. The Totem and Earthshock. Moderate nature damage, slowing an enemy's attack into enemies, and thus convenient to cast while melee attacking. So if I'm not going to be a melee attacker with this character, then it doesn't serve a whole lot of purpose, I guess. But it's there, I guess, in case I'm being beaten up on or something and I, I don't really think you need your totem here too you got a totem bar right so I'm just going to remove that alright let's just take a quick look at the mini map 
Okay, got a whole bunch of, we gotta kill wolves. Plain striders over here, gotta kill gnolls. Uh, kill a whole bunch of these swoop quill. They get trophies. Right. Well, I guess you gotta kill something else to get trophies. So let, well, actually let's go for the gnolls. I remember this one before when I did run through this <clears throat> and um, they're only all like located in a small area and yeah, that's kind of weird. And they had like a problem respawning or something. <laughs> I don't know what it was. I remember having problems just trying to find enough gnolls to kill for the quest. Alright, I'll pause here while I make my way over there. Alright, well you know what? I, I went like a couple of feet and uh, I'm noticing just about everything out here I have to kill. <laughs> like the prairie wolves. These swoop birds, those are the birds that give you the trophies, and then these the plane striders obviously give you some talons. So basically, when you go to that, that little place, when, once you leave it with these three quests, you're going to kill basically every living creature you can think of. So they, they try to make these guys out to be all kind of, you know, how do I put that down? Oh, okay. Look at that, I got some kind of totem, I don't even know what it does, but... Ooh! Cool. All right. So, what's the deal with the totems? They just stay there, or you just reset them every time you get into combat? Yeah. Well, I guess the main thing is me spamming this. Uh, I cast that. I cast that, and then that. All right. Well, at least I have a few abilities now to, uh, you know, fiddle around with. That's kind of neat. What kind of range do these things have? They actually say what the ranges are on them. Doesn't say. I seem to be getting something from this, so. Summons, it told them increase strength and agility. So I think if you're doing the melee one, strength and agility is probably important to you, but uh, this guy might not really be benefiting from this totem much. My guess is, like, when you're starting off here initially, though, the you're going to be kind of more melee than you are caster, but nah, it won't matter. So I guess I'll just kill some things until we get to the gnolls, which are you can sort of see them over there. So these these fun-loving lo nature guys just like murdering everything in their path, uh, every living creature, which I find really kind of strange, but uh, yeah. All right, well, we'll pause. Okay, I had to come back. Someone logged out here. They they died. I mean, for crying out loud, are you that stupid? And you died against what? What are these level six creatures? <laughs> uh, that's sad, man. Really sad. Killing the gnolls. And so I think this new format is going to be better for us anyway, guys, so, because, uh, you know, I wanted to give longer episodes and talk a little bit more like I'm doing now. Because honestly, right now, uh, the, we had it just up until uh, those first two episodes where I was just trying to make sure I just I didn't really show much because, uh, well, you know, because of time constraints and how long I, every second mattered as far as rendering time goes. So... I think this is just going to be ultimately better this way anyway. So we won't have to worry. I can go to the full 15 minutes on these little episodes and cool, yay, great, wonderful. That, I really like that. So I hope you guys are enjoying it. I mean, I've gotten some pretty positive feedback so far um, from the few people that do watch my Warcraft videos. Um, obviously, I kind of wish more people watch Warcraft or were into Warcraft. But uh, I know what my bread and butter has always been Minecraft. So if you guys are new and you know to the channel, you know check out my Minecraft videos too if you're into Minecraft. You know um, I'm gonna pause here and just do a lot more murdering and killing of creatures and stuff because that's really what shamans do. I imagine if you were a druid, you'd be doing the same darn quest. So yeah, murdering creatures—that's that's really nature-like of these guys. Bunch of freaking hypocrites. <laughs> so we'll be right back. Okay, and I finished those three, and I noticed I missed one other one in the village. Um, I'll make sure I grab first aid and all these little low-level skills, and also 
link my uh, hearthstone here so I'm not teleported back to the wrong area. I'm pretty unfamiliar with this torrent starter area. I'm not really sure what changes they made. I think they actually made that other torrent um, before Cataclysm. I just never played them. I never deleted them either, but uh, yeah, I'm going to have to do some looking around the town here in a little bit too because I need some bags. Uh, okay, we get a new cloak and a new level. Yay! Okay, use the drums of the smooth earth to calm six agitated earth spirits. Oh. Wait a minute. I got another one. Find such and such. Okay. Oh, now there's one over there. Oh, I'm so confused. I gotta go get all these new quests and turn in all this stuff. Um, I tell you what, I'm gonna pause here, do all this, grab all these new quests, and uh, oh, bring eight one fairy talons. Yeah, kill more things and give us more stuff. Cause it's like it's not enough. All right, I'll pause here again. Okay, I'm back, and I think we're gonna probably end the episode right after this here. Um, I essentially grabbed up all the quests I could in this area. Um, I actually grabbed two professions. Um, I decided to pick just skinning and herbalism for this guy. Uh, I picked up all the other ones. I didn't have enough money to uh, do much with anything else. I couldn't buy any bags yet. I really only have like one silver left, so I can't do much. And then they got this one here, which I think you actually have to fly someplace for the quest and I was going to end on that note let's see here they actually want me to fly to Thunder Bluff um, I don't know if I want to do that yet I actually think I want to finish the quest here first so I think uh, next time we'll just um, we'll pick up right from here okay um, in our next episode we'll do all the other quests and we'll probably do this delivery one later so Hopefully this was uh, an exciting episode. Let me know how 720p works for you. If you, you know, maybe that, I think some people commented that they, that's usually what they watch anyway. Um, so hopefully you like the format change. At any rate, it's still high definition. It's still going to look a lot better than my old series looked. So there's Flame Broiled. He's all ready to go. He's tenderized and all spiced up mouth-watering. I'm very hungry now. I gotta go. Alright guys, catch you next time.